Beekeeping is something what runs deep in my blood. I am a third generation beekeeper. My grandfather teach my father, my father teach me. So now I'm passing that knowledge to my kids, hoping one day they will do the same. My name is Luis. I've been working in this place for six years. And as you can see, I'm the beekeeper. doing since we're about to start working with bees I'm putting a little bit of a smoke so the bees know we're about to start hopping the hive and maybe try to relax a little bit the bees I'm gonna pull one of the frames to see how the frames look like so what I'm trying to see if is if all the frame is full of honey but also it's capped Heavy. When it's open, it's nectar and it's still having a little bit of humidity in. Once the bees take away all the humidity, the bees will cap it and then we'll be ready to harvest. This is closed, this is ready to harvest. This is still have to be filled up before the bees cap it. We're gonna open a little hive. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna try to show you two different kinds of queens. I'm taking a look on this frame to see what I what I can find. Let's see a little bit of fresh nectar. It's from a different kind of queen. Right here is nectar, mm -hmm. is honey. And if you take a look on this side, you can see some of the nectar, but also you can see some of the larvas. And if you take a look right here, there are some eggs. And I want you to take a look and see if you can see it. Every bee have a different distinctive smell. So if one go from here to another, maybe we'll be killed because it will be considered an intruder or a robber. This is the queen. These are the bees, females. And this right here is a drone, male. And the only purpose of the drones in the colonies is to mate with the queen. And if you know which one is the drone, you maybe can grab it and you don't get the stone because he don't has a stinger. Mm. So what you are looking here is some of the honey what we harvest in this place. As you can see, this honey is still completely liquid. And then this is going into the sec second stage. It's getting crystallized. And then finally, this honey, what is in the last stage, and it's completely crystallized. And let's remember, the honey has to go through this process when it's natural honey. So it will go from liquefy to crystallize. And this, the kids send it to me. Every year, I have the chance to go to the school to share this knowledge with all the kids hoping one day, one of days, we'll become a beekeeper.